Hey guys, Gaz Burrows at BurrowsPT.com and um, I wanted to share today another tip that you can use that will help you break through plateaus and continue with your uh, fat loss goals. Now, we all know the um, importance of eating in a calorie deficit and then um, ensuring you exercise regularly to, um, to, to elicit a fat loss response. And I was discussing this with a client in the gym the other day, and we were talking about how um, certain people hit plateaus and they can't seem to break them. And um, I wanted to share a tip that I, you've, you've probably seen me doing it whilst, um, you know, filming my workouts in the past, and it's, it's really easy and it could elicit a big response. So... Um, you might be going to the gym, you might have a weight training routine and um, you might have got some results. It might over time, results might have slowed and you might results might have ground to a halt. So I wanted to talk about the rest periods. So say if you're performing a set of barbell squats, brilliant exercise or deadlifts, do you know what I mean? Brilliant exercises, um, say 5-5 five, five, for example, you're doing 5-5. Five, five. During your rest periods, usually you'd be looking at around a two minute rest period on a 5-5 five, five workout. Um, during your rest periods, instead of stopping completely, or like boom, 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 rest, then go in again, try just walking about, getting some more steps in, um, just keeping the heart rate at a moderate pace, and then um, just keep you moving, burning a few more calories in the process. Um, so you have enough time to get your breath back and get, get the energy levels up again. But you're also moving, so you, you, you're still burning calories and still keeping the heart rate high. Um, I see a lot of people, they do the set and they just sit down. Um, and when, with clients in the past who are trying for big fat loss results, they, 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 want, they want big results, I encourage what I call active rest or active recovery, where during the rest periods, I get them to just walk up and down the gym, getting more steps in and keeping the heart rate high. Um, you could take it up a notch and perform a cardio exercise such as burpees, mountain climbers, squat throws, sprints, shuttle runs. Something like that is pretty extreme, it's pretty taxing on the nervous system and be quite, quite tiring. But again, in between your weighted routines, keep the heart rate high and um, get some cardio in. So yeah, I do that myself. I walk about, I uh, keep the heart rate high and get the steps in. And um, I thought it might help some of you guys if you're after a fat loss response just to burn some additional calories and um, keep the heart ticking over um, whilst performing your strength-based stuff. So yeah, um, cheers guys. Hopefully that helps.